And these guys right here, these newfies do just that. Kramer and Rio, they are here from the Newfoundland Dog Rescue. Lou Hall with the group is also here. And Christy Kayea, uh, you're with the Newfoundland Club uh, of Florida, yep, correct? Yep, the Newfoundland Club of Florida, that's correct. Okay, mm -hmm. so tell me first off about these dogs because, again, they do double takes. And I'm sure the big question that everyone asks is how much do they weigh or how big are they? The average dog, a male would weigh anyway from 110 to 150, female being about 110 to about 120. The, a lot of things you always want to be concerned about the larger breed is that you don't let them get overweight. They carry a lot of fur, but you yeah. always want to be able to fill their ribs because the older they get, if they're overweight, then it just puts a lot of stress on them. Right, and you were telling me that Kramer's a puppy. Yes, he's only 15 <laughs> months old, so yes, he's just a pup. <laughs> oh, goodness. Now, you all are having a big fundraiser today. Yes, Very important. we are. Tell me a little bit about that. Uh, it's the fifth annual Droolapalooza, and we're holding it at Tweeds Lands in Largo, Florida. And we have people that come out and bull because dogs don't have thumbs. Oh. So uh, they can't throw the ball. They're not really very good at rolling the ball, but uh, we've got a bowling center with maximum capacity bowlers, and we got maximum capacity dogs. Yeah. <laughs> so it's a fun situation for all. I think this is the longest tongue I've ever seen uh, on a dog, in, in person anyway. Um, what does this money mean to your rescue? Because I'm sure, you know, these guys cost a lot, and as far as medical care and food, let alone, would, would be very expensive. Yeah, fortunately, this is one of, our, uh, one of our good fundraisers for us. We have several. We have, we try to do different fundraisers throughout the years to help or throughout the year to help us raise money because you can imagine just doing one surgery on one of these guys it, right. it ranges up in the thousands uh, right. we've got several dogs right now that are available for adoption but unfortunately they all have some medical issues one that's got to have orthopedic surgery done before she's even available for um, rescue <laughs> or available for adoption right and um, it's, it ranges anywhere from the average surgery is about two thousand yeah. dollars. So, goodness, and we have to point out that Rio and Kramer are not up for adoption no, because I'm sure not. a lot of our viewers would be calling <laughs> saying, "Hey, I really want that must dog." Must have one now, yes. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Okay, so real quick, just before we go, again, just put up that information uh, about the bowling. It's going to be at Tweeds Lanes in Largo, Florida, okay. and it's going to be they can meet and greet the newfies from twelve until one. And then from 1 o'clock with reservations, we hopefully will be able to get them on the lanes. If nothing else, they can come in and buy lots of raffle tickets and brown bag auction items. And they can help support our puppies. Oh, that's great. Yeah, they're big puppies. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Thank you guys so much for coming in. The dogs are just wonderful Thank animals. You. Jeff, over to you. Looks like a fun event. So a mom recently went on television complaining about a strip club that hired...